we're gonna say something funny. Should you accept gifts, right? Mm-hmm. From the opposite sex, if you are in a relationship, should you? I mean, that's me expected. Them expected. I mean, we in a relationship. We supposed to give you gifts. Right? No, 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 no. From somebody else. Oh. From somebody else. That's why I said that's a hard. No, nah, because you know what? Especially dudes, they don't. They offer like this is how dudes are. They offer all this stuff. Be like, you know, I can do this for you. I can do that. You help me trying to get you this and all that stuff or whatever. Then here comes the question. What's the question, y'all? Should you? Oh, what's the question? No, this one was what you gonna give me? Oh, yeah, 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 what? yeah, yeah. What? Yeah. No, you can have your gift back. No, thank you. You can have it back. Mm-hmm. Like, no, they, thank you. They come back. Like that kills me. Like if you gonna do it, do it because you do it. I'm not asking you to do it because you do it. I don't give a single heart. Don't do it and expect something back because you know. Go ahead. Go ahead, uh, Nicole. Oh, I'm not on my point. Um, see, I think the reason why is because if I accept a gift from another guy, my boyfriend's gonna be thinking, okay, what's really going on? First of all, I didn't buy no ring. I definitely didn't get you these nice shoes that cost two hundred dollars. And where you get your hair done from? You don't never get your hair done on um every every weekend. You be getting your hair done for the past six months. Every week. What's going on? They gonna wanna know. So I mean that's what's gonna mess up my relationship. I'm not gonna accept it. Even though it is a little hard for me to not accept it because I would like to not get it. Keep it all the way wood. PS. Listen. You, you want know what I mean? That is difficult coming away something that you want. But at the same time, you know, like, why are you, you doing this for a reason? True. Yeah, I had some guy do that to me where they try to, um, what was it? Oh, I was going to a prom. I ain't even dealt with no prom before. But this dude kept saying, oh, I'll get you this. I'll buy you this dress. Da, da, da. Why? We ain't together. I told you, he locked up, man. Leave me alone. Like, <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> he'll come out and kill you. But nah, he was like, he was like, man, I'll buy you this, I'll buy you that, da, da. okay, and what do you want out of this? Nothing, I'll just get you this, I'll get you that. I ain't, I ain't doing that. But he was serious, though. He was about to give me, like, he was about to buy my dress, he was about to pay for me to get in, buy me some food, everything. But he wants something, though. That's why Men do that because they want something. Like, I mean, they always want something. <laughs> they claim, I mean, I don't know. My, my experience with that is, like, they offer to do a whole bunch of stuff. But then when you be like, oh, oh that's nice, or whatever, you know, I don't, you know. And they be like, well, what you going to give me? Well, I didn't ask you to give me anything in the first place. So don't, you know, that's my whole big thing with it. Like, you do it, do it because that's something you want to do. Don't do it in front of her and ask me what we're going to do. Um, so, my intake, right, what don't hurt, don't hurt, I mean, what don't, what he don't know, don't hurt, no, okay, that's too much, uh, uh, <laughs> uh, uh. I can't even say that, I'm playing for real, I'm playing, what he don't know, won't hurt, but I'm playing for real, like, for real, because I wouldn't want him doing that, and accepting no gifts, and I'm not aware of it, and then on top of that, like, it's not just accepting gifts alone, like, like Katasha said, like I said, he gonna want, and like Mr. Style said, they gonna want something in return, point blank, period, you gonna want something in return, you know what I'm saying, like, you human, you know what I mean, they gonna, but that's just too much, it's too much, it's too, it's too close to home, and ain't nobody got time for that, because, um, at the end of the day, he is who I'm coming home to, he is who I'm sleeping next to, and if it's unexpected gifts for showing up, bills being paid, full takeout, I got takeout in the refrigerator. Where that food come from? Oh, you and your girls met up again? Oh, again? Oh, again? 
Oh, this is nice. This is this a restaurant. When y'all go over here, I thought you just asked me for some money. Now you don't need no money, but you just ate from here. Yeah, that's that's right, right. Your gas ain't gonna full. Amen. Yes. Mm-mm. Wait, hold on. Money just I'm showing good. up, okay? <laughs> don't all she you have it? Like, I'm doing. She just got me. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> shut up. She look. Shut up. Bring Where the law to this. That's <laughs> look, listen. It's going It's coming from somewhere. So they ain't stupid. It only gonna take so long. They all want to believe it. Now they get on my nerves because when you start, when a woman, like we were talking about earlier, when women woman start doing something, and I'm not condoning that. I mean, uh, cheating or anything like. But when a woman starts doing something um, and that a man was doing in an unhealthy relationship, so they get real in their feelings real quick. So let them do something. They want you to forgive them. But, you know, we don't stop that because that just came to my mind. I'm just saying they get in their feelings real quick. And they get on my nerves when they sick. Uh, yes. When they sick, they act like they dying. But yes. when I'm sick, they can't take care of me. But when they sick, they dying on their deathbed, dying like, oh, babe, oh, my God. I'm like, uh-uh, uh-uh. Here, chicken noodle soup is on the corner. I mean, on the corner. On the <laughs> counter. Look, uh, the medicine next to you, the halls is next to you. I'm going to work. I'm going to have dinner. Oh, that's when you be watching them look sick. Let me stop doing that. I'm just going in. But uh, if y'all want to commentate off what I just said, do you smell good or is that my breath? I think you are one of It's always like that. Like almost every guy I talk to, they can interview or they'll answer their phone. Just, you know, just something, just throwing something out there, right? You know, if they be like, oh, well, you should be your ass well. Let you not answer your phone. World War Three. Why you answer your phone? Ooh, ooh. I'm like, and they, they can't handle their own medicine. That's the thing. Okay. Men right. cannot take their own medicine. Like, and then sometimes you don't even be doing it to be petty. Oh, man, I wasn't, so I wasn't up on, at all, but go ahead. It's just the phone man. Go ahead. My bad. You don't mean to be petty. You don't mean to be petty, but it's just like, it just you know, like certain situations, like, boom, it just happened. And it's like, oh, you do it on purpose. You just doing it because I'm like, no. I mean, it just happens. If you can't take your own medicine, you did it to me. It was okay when you did it. But when I do it, oh, oh, oh. I'm done. It's true. Y'all know y'all be like that. Don't ask. We're going to speak for you. We're going to speak for you. Yeah, I know y'all be like that. I'm just saying. Keep it real, okay? Well, I am going to agree with that. Uh, they can call me. Uh, why you can call? Why can't answer your phone? Okay, for one. I'll be calling you. Well, this is before. I'll be calling you. Dialing my. Hey, there. You gonna send me a voicemail? I know it's a ring twice. You send me the voicemail. What's really going on? Like, that's how I'll be. Why are you sending me the voicemail? Oh, I don't feel like talking to you. I haven't so talked to you for like since last night. And you act like, I've been, like I'm bugging you or something. That's why yeah. guys do that most of the time. You can't do it. They have myriad. Uh, I'm about to say, what the heck is that? Yeah, myriad, community. Especially when I'm Oh, my finger went over. I was like, what the heck is that? So, I feel like I need to repeat myself because the music was turned up a little loud. And I'm going to be really mad about this audio if it's messed up when I edit it. Yeah, I might have to repeat myself again. I know, right? 